What's up everyone, welcome back. It's been a little while since I made a video, but I'm here to talk about Magic Mirror, pretty much, and dashboard. So, think about it. So, we all want a little digital dashboard here and there. Um, so, I have two of them. So, one is using the Raspberry Pi, and then I came across the Samsung, the Frame TV. So, apparently, the 32 inch and the, uh, this is the 43 inch, then you could actually mount them vertical and you could actually um, use a, a Magic Mirror server. If you were have a Magic Mirror server like I do, running on a, like a virtual machine somewhere. Um, so I have my uh, Magic Mirror running as a virtual machine and it's tucked in you know, my little server closet. And I could just point the web browser from the TV directly to that Magic Mirror server IP and pull up, boom, a whole dashboard right there on the screen. So imagine that. Imagine just using the TV itself without anything hooked up to it, no HDMI cords, no Raspberry Pis, nothing at all, just the display, the dashboard, showing me everything I need to know, my calendar, my weather, my home assistant, plugins. Um, it's just, it's one of the best moves I ever did. So if anyone out there trying to do a digital dashboard or even a, a magic mirror, the whole full setup with the with the, uh, the mirror, um, the glass, um, I say go for it, man, I say go for it. I say, if I was gonna do anything, create a whole magic mirror setup, I would definitely do the Samsung Frank TVs. No way I would do anything else. Um, if you wanna set up the magic mirror server, the link below in the description, you can set up your magic mirror server running and also you can use the server and point to multiple different dashboards. Say if you want like five dashboards, you want one in your bedroom, downstairs, closet, bathroom maybe. Um, you could just use this server to just pop up, like just input the URL and boom, you have your dashboard up and running. The secret to this is that every um, uh, 32 inch and 43 inch Samsung TVs can be mounted vertically. So you get a nice little vertical menu. As you can see it fits nice so what basically I did was I dropped the Raspberry Pi pretty much and used the built-in web browser all right let me get the apps here all right let's just open all the apps so basically this is the internet browser here um, you put in your IP address of your uh, magic mirror server and boom, that's it, and pops right up. And then you make sure you um, enable the uh, the plugin to hide the uh, the mouse. So I'll have everything in the description below, but make sure you have that plugin because if you don't have it, the mouse will, you know, see? You're gonna have this mouse moving around or, or it's gonna be visible, basically. So if you have the plugin, it just disappears and you got this nice, clean, smooth look. Everything looking good, nice. Um, the 43 inch frame TV, I think is the best option for anybody who's trying to do a magic mirror dashboard. This is the best of the best. Like I said, vertically, and you could even watch TV on here if you want to watch some um, source, some Apple TV, you could still do that. You know what I'm saying? You could do all of that right here on this uh, dashboard. So basically, do all of that all of that on the dashboard so i think it's a it's a great option for anyone who's want to get into um having a nice sleek looking dashboard no buttons no um no branding on there um it's a sleek looking tv yeah i said this is the best option right here